what it is, YouTube. This is your boy, Spray Man, back at you with another video, man. The other half of it's time for that Culture for the Street podcast, top of the morning, man. So these people are locked up, NBA young boy. He was taken into custody in Utah and charges of patterns of unlawful activity, attempting to pursue drugs, identity fraud, forgery, possession of controlled substances, possession of a dangerous weapon. Now, this the thing. YB had it already said that his, his probation officer had done told him to stop using drugs. And you know when you got these stipulations on probation or whatever the case may be, they might not come get you right away, but best believe they coming to get you. And not to mention all of this social media ranting. You feel me? Niggas be forgetting. Just like how it happened to Honeycomb Brazy. If you got a probation officer, a parole officer, things like that, anything got to do with law enforcement, bro. When they come down to them stipulations, man, they don't care nothing about you being no rapper. You got to follow these guidelines. You are no different from no other person that's on probation or parole. And a lot of people saying, like, how this nigga catch all of these charges on house arrest? Well, if you keep posting it on IG and the, and the, and the, and the PO telling you to stop doing drugs and you still doing it, then they're they going to try to re revoke your federal probation. You know what I mean? It ain't no exception. Why you think Finesse said he don't want to play with his federal probation officer like that? Why you think BG is not trying to play with the federal probation officers? Man, them boys trying to move right because they not trying to go back to prison and play with these federal probation officers. Nigga, you not going to the state. You going to the feds, playboy. You feel me? You you on man time. And for a nigga like BG, not to get off subject, niggas like BG, Finesse, Gucci. You see when they came home from 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 um federal prison, how them boys been moving. You ain't seen Finesse smoke no blunt. You ain't seen uh, uh Gucci smoke no blunt like Bro, they trying to put the old them in the past because they not trying to go back down the road and deal with niggas getting stabbed up, niggas passing gas all in your cell, nigga might be playing all kind of zesty games and things like that, bro. When you out here on the free world and you get a taste of this, 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 this free world after you've been gone so many years, man, all that bull crap be obsolete, nigga. You feel me? All them fake friends, niggas cutting all of them off and everything. Niggas trying to get their life in order because ain't nobody trying to go back down that road. But on another note, you know what I mean? Free YB. This time when he come home, maybe he come home with a more polished mindset and he won't be doing so much social media rant because y'all know all it takes for there's a little piece of fire to come towards a firecracker and this nigga gon' he gonna blow up. Y'all drop a comment below and let me know what y'all think about that. About NBA young boy being taken into custody in Utah, man. I'm gone.